Good morning! It's another sunny, beautiful day here in Tokyo. Nothing suspicious or different at all going to be happening. Nah, I'm just kidding. As you can tell, I'm dressed up as Yoshi. We are doing the Mario Karts today. Uh, we're here at the Shinigawa location. Uh, we have booked a two hour Mario Kart expedition. So we're gonna be driving around the streets of Tokyo, dressed up like characters of from the Mario games. Uh, it should be fun. Uh, so a couple of things. It's about 7,000 yen uh, per person for the two hour ride and about 90,000, sorry, 9,000 uh, for the three hour one. So if you convert it to American dollars, it's probably about 70 bucks for the two hours and 90 dollars for the three hour ride. You do need an international license in order to uh, participate. Uh, so ensure you do that. Do that. Uh, there are various locations. There's one in Shinigawa, there's one in Akihabara. I believe other cities around uh, Japan also do offer it as well. I think Osaka and Kyoto may have them, but basically the Tokyo ones are the main ones. Uh, so we're here to do the two hour ride. Uh, it should be pretty fun. At the moment there's only one go-kart here at the moment, but there will be more coming back uh, from their ride, so I'll get some footage of that. Uh, they do allow you to bring your own uh, GoPros um, and if you don't have them, there's straps you can hire, you can hire action cameras from them. Uh, here's one right now. Hey. So they're pretty small, pretty agile, pretty fun. I think they get up to a decent speed, but obviously we're not going to be going that fast because uh, there will be a group of us. We'll basically just follow the leader uh, around the streets of Tokyo. So it should be an awesome experience. Um, Mel and I are all kitted up in our costumes. I am the Yoshi, uh, Mel is Mario, and I do have my GoPro camera on my forehead. Oh, I will have it right now, right now. Uh, but it's going to be an awesome experience. So more footage and more action to come.
So we just finished up here, uh, Mario Kart, uh, Mario Kart go kart racing. As you can see, all the go karts behind us, they're just moving them, ready for the new uh, batch of people to go through. And it was an amazing experience. I have to say, it'd be one of the best things we've done in Tokyo for this trip. Uh, it was so much fun. Uh, it was about a two and a half ish hour ride all around Tokyo. We went to through to Shibuya Crossing and around and it was just so much fun. Uh, highly, highly recommend uh, trying it if you're in Tokyo or in Osaka. Uh, they do have um, a shop up in Osaka as well and multiple stations uh, in Tokyo. There's one in Akihabara, there's one in Shinigawa here. Um, but yeah, look them up. Um, you definitely can't miss them. Uh, I think it's marikar.com. Um, they have Facebook as well and they're really really responsive on Facebook so if you message them they'll definitely um, reply back in a day or so um, it was such a cool experience like driving on all the roads not just the small roads but on the big roads as well uh, around Tokyo uh, it's very well coordinated it's very safe the Japanese drivers are very safe um, they're pretty cautious I would highly recommend doing it it's about I think it's it's 8,000 yen um, for two hours, but if you like them on Facebook, you get a uh, thousand yen off. So it's only seven thousand yen. So it's about seventy bucks US for two hours, and it is an awesome experience. It is so much fun. Um, I can't, I can't, can't encourage enough and recommend enough this. Uh, it's definitely, definitely a worthwhile experience if you come to Japan, uh, especially in Tokyo. So um, main, most of the people who actually do it are internationals and uh, tourists. Uh, Japanese people can do it. Uh, if you're a tourist, you do need your passport and an international license in order to drive on the streets of Tokyo. Um, and don't worry if you're from North America and you drive on the right side of the road. Uh, Mel is actually obviously you know um, used to driving on the right side of the road, um, so it's actually pretty fine because you pretty much stay within your lanes uh, and you just follow the people in front of you. So it's pretty pretty easy. Um, the driving experience itself is definitely lots of fun because you're very very low to the ground it's kind of surreal seeing all these cars zip by you it's actually like bigger trucks as well so that's pretty much it for our mario kart uh go-karting experience here in tokyo uh thanks for viewing and watching the video uh if you liked the video give it a thumbs up uh if you really liked it then please subscribe more for any more japanese travel videos and travel tips and all things travel till next time